Boss! Boss! Caribbean Connections TV will bring the Caribbean and its flavors to our viewers in a fresh, vibrant way that will entertain as well as educate. It's your direct connection to the Caribbean experience. Caribbean Connections TV. Buckle your seatbelts. This is going to be an exciting, fantastic, energetic, soul-stirring ride. So don't you move. Hey, it's Paradise, and you're watching Caribbean Connections Television, connecting the Caribbean and its people. All right, all right. Good evening, everyone. Welcome, uh, Caribbean Connections uh, viewers. We appreciate your, um, your viewing us tonight. We ask that you sit back and enjoy the show. My name is Kevin Davis. I'm playing Mr. B Jonathan Bonovich. Uh, you're about to see a show that has a, uh, a lot of comedy. Uh, it's going to draw every emotion that you can possibly imagine, as well as it's a strong message within the show itself. Um, sit back, enjoy, and we'll see you later. Are you ready, I'm rolling. Yeah, I just hope you tune in to Caribbean Connection TV. Yes, of course. Well, tonight, tonight, tonight will be another, another up hour. You know, wonderful, wonderful performers that will be doing this play. It has so much message. So what I want you all to do is to just stay focused. And for who haven't gotten um, a pampers or um, napkins and so forth, there is some in the back. So I would like you all to make sure you get your pampers and your napkin because water might be running from anywhere. Yes? <laughs> just stay tuned and just enjoy. One love. Hello. 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 Hi. Hi. How you doing? Welcome to the program. My name is Lena Allen Rowe and I play the character of Mrs. Claire Bonovich in Marcel Brown's production, I Need to Know My Father. Hi, my name is Rochelle Robinson. I play the character Lisa and it's a very good character in this play. Hi, my name is Stacey Buchanan and I play the character of Sarah Perkins and I am the granddaughter of um, the leads, so yeah. Everyone is the lead. Yeah, <laughs> I Need to Know My Father. It is a very compelling play. It has some drama, it's funny. It, honestly, if you see this, you want to see it another time, and another time, and another this, time. This play is the brainchild of Marcia Brown. Marcia Brown is the producer, writer, and director, and this is something that Marcia Brown has been thinking about for a lot of years. This is her 10th production, and over the years she's been doing production written by other Jamaican playwrights. But she decided to take the bull by the horn at this time and do her own thing, and it has been getting rave reviews. It's a play that deals with social social conditions of people. It's just not... Um, it's just not about the Caribbean. It's just not about Jamaica. It's about, it has a world history. It has, it tells a story that every family in every culture of the world goes through this, this, this situation at all times. Um, yeah. There are, in fact, there did a day, there's some man who was looking for his father and he said his name was John. And um, if my hearing heard me right, I, I thought he said that, his mother told him that his father was supposed to be John D. from Baker, who is the former Prime Minister of Canada. And this play talks about a, a father whose name is John, that the grandmother tells um, her great-granddaughter that her father's name is John, but John is such a common name. And you know, eventually we found out who the father was and a remedy, and it caused some breakup, and it caused some makeup, it caused some tears, and it caused some laughter. So as you see this play, I hope you will enjoy it, and I hope you will, you will, you will find something in your life to relate to. I need to know my father. This is my first time with Marcy Brown Productions, and I'm loving it. The class is great. The stories, the storyline, everything about it is an amazing play, and I hope you enjoy it. And if you miss this production, we play at the Rembrandt um, Center in Scarborough at 9.30 Progress Avenue next week, Sunday evening. And we also play in Ajax on Saturday. Yeah. We are also Oshawa. in Oshawa, Saturday. Oshawa, yeah. Oshawa on Saturday, and then we have Ajax, and then we have the Jamaica Canadian Center. So we still have a few more runs to do. That you can definitely catch. Yeah. Which you, yeah, which you, you can should. definitely <laughs> you should. You should not miss this play. Don't. It's a life story. It tells the story that every child yearns to hear. It touches everybody. Children, yeah. old people, mother, father, everybody touches. 
you can relate to it. This is my second time working with Marcia Brown Productions, and the great thing about working with Marcia is that Marcia not only is just a director, she actually she tell she 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 teaches you. She's mm -hmm. there for you. She's like she's like my mother, you know. And so when we get into character, when we work together, we're like a big family here. <laughs> And that's the most important thing about working with her because everybody's loved and everyone's a family and you know she she trains you she gets you into that character that you need to be but like Letna says it's the type of play that honestly everyone can relate to at least one of the characters Absolutely. in this play and this story yeah. is actually it's a story that's been told before many times so you guys have to see it I get emotional when I talk about it but it's good <laughs> it's good, it's good. so thank you for watching Thank you for listening and hope to see you at the next performance. Ta-da! <laughs> hey, it's your girl Paradise and you can now watch us on Rogers Digital Cable, channel 129. Buckle your seatbelts, we're about to take off. Caribbean Connections TV will take you back to the islands. Each week, Caribbean Connections explores new community events, from carnivals to concerts, artists, jazz festivals, culinary happenings in Canada and around the world. From Marcia Brown's play, I Need to Know My Father. I was Anyways, just joking. Are you done here? You need my room, you need some attention. No, John, I'm not coming back into your room. Mama getting suspicious. So? So? That's all I can say, Johnny, so? You think you want Mama completely blood at Jesus, no, Mama John? <laughs> you know what, John? Just forget about me, huh? Because you're going to go back up for him. I'm going to university. And, and, and what? Well, you must have a girlfriend over there. Oh, wait a minute. W where is all this coming from? I told you already. I don't have a girlfriend over there. I love you. And one day, we're going to get married. Married? John, oh, well, we'll get married. Your mother don't even like this in your own. But she's getting married? Listen, listen, listen. This has nothing to do with my mother. She, she has no control over what I have for you. Yes, I do, sir. I do. No, John, you can't love somebody who just sticks day a day a week. <laughs>
Like all the other Marcia Brown shows that I've been to, this one is a, a quality show and uh, I'm enjoying it so far. Hi, and, uh, I'm here at the Marcia Brown production watching I Want to Know My Father. So far, it's been a great show. We've been learning that, you know, fatherhood is a very important present in a child's life and... Um, this particular play is a play that I enjoy quite well because it speaks a lot to the situation of the absentee father and that fathers must take responsibility for their children. It has a lot of morals in it. It answers a lot of questions. And it's really a true-to-life story. It's the first time I'm seeing Marcia Brown production. And so far, I haven't been enjoying it. It is a true-to-life play. It brings out a lot of areas which one can put into action and make something positive of their lives. And all her shows bring a certain um, laughter, but also they bring a, a straight message to you. They bring something that hits your heart. And you know what I mean? Sometimes you can cry just after laughing by going to her shows. And you'll get that in most of them. The good thing about it, they do it all across the GTA. So everyone have an opportunity to go out and see a show. Today, of course I'm it is a fantastic play. I've seen it myself about five times now and I keep coming back and I keep laughing at the same spots and crying at the same spots again and again. And you know, we want people to know that if you've never seen a play with Jamaican themes before, with you, this play isn't even about Jamaica. This play is about life and we really, really want to encourage you to come and see it. The play is so, so much of a buzz right now. It has so much of a buzz that it's going on the cruise, the big cruise, the Four Seasons Party Cruise that's leaving from Miami on October 31st to November 4th. All you have to do is find your way there, you know. By the it's way, we're here. spending seven hours in, mm. in Jamaica. Jamaica. So we can walk up and down, go down to Uchi Rayas, Ray. <laughs> <laughs> So indeed, as we said, you know, this play is going to be going places. You want to be a part of it. Get in on the ground level and see this play because this is one of the best productions coming out of Marcia Brown Productions and we want to see it going further and further and further. 
getting married? Congratulations! Hire Caribbean Connections Television to come and capture those special memories. And if you have friends and relatives that can't make it to your wedding, we can also stream it live so they can watch it right where they are, anywhere around the world. And why stop at weddings? How about those other special memories like birthdays, graduations, funerals, and live births? Don't leave your friends and relatives out. Let them share in your special memories. Stream it live. Call us at Caribbean Connections Television.